Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a question that many web developers encounter. Our viewer is curious about how to send push notifications to users on iPhones from a web app. Specifically, they want to know if it's possible to achieve this through browsers like Chrome or Safari. Let's explore this intriguing topic together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you're looking for. Guys, let's get ready to try and work through to that resolution, and remember to just stay a little bit crazy, just like me. Now, let's continue on. To send push notifications from a web app to iPhone users, we need to understand that iOS does not support web push notifications in the same way that Android does. However, there are workarounds. One common approach is to use a service worker in conjunction with a backend server. This allows us to send notifications through a web app, but it requires user interaction to allow notifications. To implement this, first, you need to register a service worker in your web app. Here's a simple example of how to do that. Next, you will need to request permission from the user to send notifications. This can be done using the Notification API. Finally, you can send notifications using the Service Worker. This requires a push service to handle the notifications. You can use libraries like Firebase Cloud Messaging for this purpose. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. iOS supports service worker technology for offline caching, but it currently does not support web push notifications. There is an online petition urging Apple to implement web push notifications on iOS devices. You can find the petition at change.org, where you can sign and support the initiative. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. You can send push notifications from a web application, but the mobile device must first register to receive them through a native app. Once registered, the native app sends an authorization token to the server, which is used to send notifications to the device. For more detailed information, refer to Apple's guidelines on push notifications. And that's it guys. I hope the video helped find the resolution that you're looking for and you got the answer and worked your way through. If it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.